Welcome back here on Good Day Kansas. We continue today from Iola with one of the favorite people on the show. It is Colby Sharples Terry with Kansas Tourism. Colby, it's great to see you today. You too. Always fun to have you on the show. You're taking us to so many cool places every single month. And today we are at the newest state park here in Kansas. Yes. So uh, Lehigh Portland State Park is a free state park, which oh. is wonderful. And um, this area is really, really known for their trails. Mm -hmm. There's the Prairie Spirit Trail, there's the South Wind Trail. And so adding this to, you know, our state park portfolio, bringing the number to 29 <laughs> is really, really cool. Yeah. Um, my first time out here was just a couple months ago and I was blown away. Uh -huh. Like, I mean, there's over 13 miles of trails. Wow. There's tons of ecosystems. You have wetlands, you have woods, you have prairies. It's a really beautiful, like hiking, biking, all of that. Yeah. It's so opening because some people don't or people don't always think of stuff like this here in our state we're just about two hours due east of Wichita um, a little south of Kansas City so really we're in a good spot for people to come and take advantage of the state park oh for sure especially outdoor enthusiasts there's so many trails like you can spend all day long just exploring this part of the yeah. state and you will not regret it it is super cool well hey you've got me interested here so let's go take about a five minute walk in yes. and uh, see some scenic views here yeah all right, Colby. Man, this is absolutely beautiful. It's just about a five minute walk from where we just were. Yeah, so if you come into the Eastern Trailhead, that's where we met. Um, it is really a quick jaunt to get to this beautiful overlook, yeah. this picturesque view. Oh my gosh, so this is Lake Lee, right? This is Lake Lee, which helps give the name of Lehigh Portland State Park. Yeah. And um, so this was, uh, like I said, part of a former cement plant. And so all of this has public access, but it's just beautiful. There's views like this here. You're able to walk down. There's a trail just right over here that can take you down uh, below so you can be like oh, in yeah. the rocks down there and close to the water. Uh, it's just so cool. Man, there's so many cool things to see at the state park too because there's also some caves. Yeah, so um, actually you're able to um, hike like all these trails connect all around I Iola. So that's really cool. Um, but yeah, if, if we were to hop back in our vehicle from the eastern trailhead, it's a literally three minute drive to that trailhead and there's John Brown's cave. Um, and it's cool. Yeah, it's in this rocky bluff. I'm not brave enough to crawl in there, but uh, from the map, I, I'm not brave enough to do it. You're the one that held the cockroach that's last, true, that's true. last segment. But yeah, it's just neat. It's yeah. so cool. There's so much just like right here at this one state park. Yeah, man, I'm ready to come on by here and just spend a whole day here at um, Lehigh Portland State yeah. Park. But also there's other cool things going on in Iowa as well. It is. Iowa is such a cool town and they've done like just a lot of revitalization over the last several years. Um, they have the largest downtown square in the nation, which is cool. So that means lots of places to eat, shop around. Um, I know that you're going to hit up a couple places, yeah. a coffee shop. So mm -hmm. good to see you, Colby. Thanks good for being with us. Good to see you. Appreciate it. Thank you. We have more in Good Day Kansas coming up next.